located about 1530 light years from the Earth in the constellation of Cygnus, Kepler 36 is a sun-like star orbited by two known alien worlds. The inner planet, designated Kepler 36b is a so-called super-Earth, as it is larger than our home planet but smaller than Neptune, the larger Kepler 36c, resembling the solar system's outermost planet, is described as a mini-Neptune. What is unusual about this planetary system is that these two exo-worlds have very close orbits, separated only by 0.013 astronomical units, oh, five times the Earth-Moon distance. In a new research paper published online on February 9, Princeton scientists are trying to determine physical conditions and understand the evolution process of this curious, distant system. Based on the available data from NASA's Kepler exoplanet hunting spacecraft, James Owen from the Institute for Advanced Study in Princeton and Timothy Mortem of the Princeton University were looking for information that would be helpful in determining initial physical conditions of both planets. They performed hydrodynamic calculations to obtain a detailed evaporation model constraining the possible birth composition of the system. The model shows direct connection between the system's present-day observed properties and formation theories like present-day mass and radius as a function of core mass, core composition, initial envelope mass fraction, and initial cooling time. We calculate the evolution of each planet independently, including evaporation and bolometric irradiation by the central star. As we evaluate this evolution on grids of initial physical conditions, we are able to use the inferred posterior distribution of the planet's present-day properties calculated from the transit timing variations to constrain these initial conditions, the researchers wrote in the paper. They found out that Kepler-36b has an evaporatively stripped core, while Kepler-36c has retained some of its initial envelope due to its higher core mass and that both exo-worlds could have had a similar formation pathway. With a core mass of about 4.4 Earth masses, the inner planet has an initial envelope mass fraction of less than 10%. The outer planet's envelope mass fraction is estimated to be between 15 and 30% and its core mass is approximately 7.3 times the mass of the Earth. Overall, the model used by Owen and Mortem allows scientists to uncover important information about exoplanet structure shortly after formation.